Hello everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction and today it is Manchester United 2 Burnley nil. Manchester United through and advance the next round of the Carabao Cup. We are through that's what really matters back after a World Cup Lovely to see my team back in the Manchester United stripes to, to get that W. This is what was needed. In terms of performance in that first half, which was a slow start, United that then got better as the minutes went on. But our first goal came in that, in that first half. Aaron Wan-Bissaka doing something that you've never seen before. Yes, cross the ball and assist. Get the ball to Christian Eriksen for Eriksen to score his second goal of the season. Eriksen was happy. I was happy. Aaron Wan-Bissaka not so happy because he knows he's going to get sold. He didn't celebrate it off, but he was happy to just get involved and participate. Another game where we never saw Donny van der Beek. I don't know about him. But in that second half, Manchester United were well, again, they started off slightly better. But the guy himself, Sir Marcus Rashford, the solo run, the desire to get to that to that net of Bernie and feed that net like he feeds the kids. Marcus Rashford's having a good season so far. Good World Cup, or great World Cup, I would say. Three goals, a few minutes. But a ninth goal of the season, i got to say, Ten Hag knows how to get the best out of Marcus Rashford. Apart from that, Manchester United did what they had to do. Get the two goals, go through to the next round. Again, we're still in the cup. As an opportunity to win a trophy is what we're looking for to do this season. In terms of player-wise, Aaron Wan-Bissaka had a good game. Gonacho himself had a good decent 30, 30 minutes, but then again, he faded in that second half, which, which meant he had to come off. Casemiro, the guy himself, God bless him, he's a stellar man. He done everything that he had to do, man. Defensive-wise, he's better than Maguire. And if 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 um, Varane gets injured, Sandro gets injured, and Love gets injured, we put in Casemiro there because he's been a revelation in midfield and in the defence. Bruno Fernandes did what he had to do, and Rashford, oh God, he told us to shut the fuck up a couple of times, man, just like Kevin Durant did, did to that fan. He told him to shut the fuck up and watch and let me sh let me show you how I score. And he did. He scored that goal. And again, big up Rashford. I hope on Monday he gets his 10th goal of the season and gets the double figures because we need players in double figures if we want to have a strong second half for the season. But from that, man, the match has to go to Casemiro. Brilliant. Brilliant in defence, brilliant overall. Thank God we signed him. It was a defensive midfield that we needed in the longest time. Don't give the match the Brafka. So many mistakes. Could have scored an own goal. You know, first touch was trouble. We was complimenting him in his touches on the ball, and then he just almost makes some mistakes. It is what it is. But Manchester United fans, it is what it is. Take it one game at a time because Monday, it is Boxing Day. The Premier League is back. We're happy with this win. That's all we wanted, the win. Performance-wise, you know, sometimes you don't always have to perform to win, you know, as long as you get the W. Great teams, even when they don't play well, they get the W, and that's what we want. We want a team that can get the W. Apart from that, guys, this has been your match reaction from your boy, Ivor and Spice. Smash the like button, subscribe. Let me know who your man of the match is. Let me know your donkey of the matches as well, and let me know your thoughts of the match in the comments. Press the notification bell once you subscribe. And as always... Remember to keep it united. Remember to keep it red united and follow all the socials. Peace.